Hey, uh, sorry. Hey, Dan and Nikki, this is just a video I wanted to um, introduce really quick. Um, in town, they have a, um, a Beethoven festival, uh, and that runs July and part of August. It runs roughly during the same time as Shakespeare Fest is running. And they attract some really big names. Uh, Yo-Yo Ma was here last year, uh, the year before. I can't remember the name, the guy's name, but he was a violinist and apparently the top violinist, classical violinist in the world. Um, and so they have lots of different venues. They have small theaters. They have large auditoriums. They have they play at the Marine Art Museum. Um, and uh, but to start the season off. Uh, which always starts July 4th. They have a free concert out on the grass at the band shell um, down at Lake Winona. And this year uh, was actually the first year I've gone because usually every year I'm busy with, you know, with Shakespeare. But I went and the, um, the group that was playing was called Empire Brass, which is one of the top, if not the top quintet in North America, a uh, brass quintet. And they were they were awesome. They played classical. They played blues. They played jazz, um, and um, um, and I got a little bit of video. I, I the video that you're going to watch is I, I sort of shot the stage and kind of the, the surrounding area. Um, so it was interesting because when I showed up, um, it, there was a huge crowd, and it's like uh, it's like oh man, I guess I'm not going to be able to sit anywhere near the stage. Um, but as I walked up, there was a, there was like an arc of people, um, all of whom were, you know, at least 20 yards away from the stage, this sort of nice arc right around the stage. Um, and what I realized is I thought there was a barrier or something keeping them back. But what I realized was that this was just Minnesota people being really nice and nobody wanted to sit close. So I went up and sat, you know, 10 yards away from the stage right in the middle, you know, sort of by myself. Um, and then eventually other people came and sat, you know, kind of near me. Um, but uh, I shot one little quick video of when they were actually playing. And, and I was thinking to myself when I was shooting this, oh, I really should shoot more because they were, they were playing a Miles Davis piece. And I thought it would be nice to go to, sh to show them. But I was trying to be surreptitious about it because I just somehow felt that I shouldn't be doing it. Um, and, and each of the members of the quintet, except for the drummer, uh, who, of course, wasn't playing brass, had a um they had the bell on their horns mic'd and then they had um uh that led to a wire that led on, on a wire led to a um um a little transmitter that they wore on their belt um to the sound guy and so the guy who was playing uh trumpet um was sort of the leader of this quintet would came off stage on several occasions and actually played in and amongst the people um, which was really cool. But one thing he did um, right after I was done shooting this part of the video is he um, he came down off the stage and went like two people over from me and he was standing in front of this guy playing and then he leaned down and he was playing like right next to the grass and I was like, what is he doing? And I lean over and look and what he was doing is he had stuck his bell right over the microphone on this really high-end audio recorder, uh, this digital audio recorder and was playing really loudly right into the mic. Um, and so essentially he told, and then he went up and whispered to this guy, you know, no recordings, um, you know, of our concerts. And so he was actually literally went through the crowd, finding the people who were videotaping and asking them to stop. It was, it was actually really funny. So, uh, unfortunately he didn't see me. Um, anyway, so this is a little Empire Brass, uh, and this is the July 4th concert, uh, on the green at Lake Winona. So, uh, go USA. Yeah, plus in, over here there's shade. There's shade. I don't you get to sit dead center. Yeah. And I'm listening to this sax solo, and nothing's coming out over on this side. Oh, interesting. It's all over here, so I don't know if they have their, their setup balance down there. So perfect. Right. Okay, just stay here, Mom. I'm going to get the chair. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
it lightning over there? Yeah, I don't think so. Is there anything happening after this? Yes. Going home and going to bed. No, like here. Yeah, right.